He's a mega fashion icon in the K-pop world. Through the form, G Dragon opened his first solo concert here in a flashy red outfit, complete with a flashier supercar. His fans would expect nothing less. His style, like Big Bang style, is very um, different from the other K-pop groups. Mm -hmm. Like they are very, how to say, a bit like hip-hop. He's cool mm -hmm. and you know he has that whole bad boy thing going on that goes soon after. And his daring sartorial choices have won over people in the fashion industry too. He's not really your traditionally handsome type of a star and mm -hmm. um, so I think the fashion element really helps project a lot of his uh, personality. I think he dares to try something different. Mm -hmm. um, I would think he's more of a trendsetter. He's a very pop character but then he wears some unheard of designers and makes it look you know hot and you know the way he makes his ambush with you know some Givenchy stuff he wears and you know I think he's a natural, you know. I don't think anyone told him to do it that way or yeah, he's definitely over the years has has developed his own style like that's very distinct to him. So that's really um fun watching, you know. But despite him bagging style icon awards and starting fashion trends, G Dragon has his fair share of fashion faux pas too when he pushed the boundaries a bit too much. Fashion faux pas. Yeah, I think so mm. because like there was a rich video, I think crayon yeah, there was one like his hair really like, you know, like dreadlocks, like long. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that was, was a bit really nice. like much. <laughs> I, I thought it was too much. Really? really? You thought it's nice? I think it's nice for like, you know, photo shoots and like, you know, videos and stuff. But not on a uh, normal daily, daily life basis. I, I felt guess. like it overwhelmed him. I think maybe the crazy, the overly crazy makeup. Mm. Mm. Like he's, he always has this like super exaggerated like, like eyeliner and stuff like that. Mm. Yeah, I think that, you know. Going a bit more natural is better. Mm. Not everyone was a fan of his auntie look during his concert stop in Taiwan either. But when asked about it, G Dragon said in his defense. Mm. <laughs> So is there anything that G Dragon wouldn't do in the name of fashion? So fans would just have to settle with his topless photos then. For more on G Dragon's concert in Singapore, check out our other clips. Are you ready?